part in here where I got it in my garage. I got a snow blower right there with the handle folded down so it won't take up a lot of room. And uh, as you can see, it's it parked right up against the wall and our steps going in and how much room we have uh, in our garage with all we have is the one electric car that we keep in here. We keep our van outside and uh, we've got plenty of room in here, uh, you know, with it sitting over here like it is. So now we're going to take it out and drive it. I'm going to do a little video on this little extreme bike that we bought a while back. You know, we did one video and um, it's electric and here's my wife in here and you see this little sidecar I kind of built I used the, uh, the frame that the bike came with up underneath it so let me get down here you can see it maybe I don't know if you can see it underneath there or not but I added to it to make it a little bit wider and uh, came up with this little design. I bought this bicycle wheel off of eBay for $200 or so and uh, I made all this frame and stuff for it and as you can see we've got little carriers on it and in the uh, uh, inside here there's where I put the motor controller and stuff and uh, I ran the wires over to the motorcycle I mean motor scooter uh, for the uh, the voltage on it uh, first off I run the I tried to operate it off of the the, the, the motor controller off of the motorcycle but so I would only have to use a, one thing, but that wouldn't work. So I ended up making a little pipe and putting it inside of here. And uh, then when I need the power for the, uh, like just mostly going up hills, the rest of the time the bike pulls me and her and this little thing just fine. But when we start to go up hills, then it's a problem. I bought these, looks like I got my light stone right there, as you can see. Well, maybe you can't <laughs> too much light on it, maybe, I don't know. But, uh, I put lights on it down there, and we've called it, as you can see, I've got that tag made off of eBay as, as well. And I made them little bumpers by taking a, a strip of uh, aluminum and flashing, and I wrapped it around the board. And my wife got them little letters that says Mr. and Mrs. on it. And like I said, I just took the parts, the metal that came with the frame when they shipped the bike to us and welded the pieces. And I bought a, a bracket at Ace to hook it on to. And there it is. Lights are all working. And... Uh, I had a Uga horn on it, but it broke. So I'm going to get another kind of horn later on. I put that mirror on there so she can look at herself. And I bought this windshield off of Amazon for, I think, 35 bucks delivered. I made this door so it's easy for her to pull it, yeah, to get in and out. And just sits in the seat and then sits over there to get in it. It's not too bad of a deal now the bike itself doesn't do very well on hills uh, with just the the motor now you're gonna have to hold it and make sure what you're looking at you're looking at the windshield right now uh, okay we're going down the hill in it and we just and came. there he is <laughs> around our neighborhood here and we and just says we did five kilometers I'm just now, taking a 
I'm looking at the speedometer right now, just pulling off. I'm on only the motorcycle, and it's doing 28, 29, 30. Viewing, taking some pictures out in our neighborhood as we drive along and I sit in this little seat. I bought that little seat that's in there from Walmart. They, they call them, I think, uh, stadium seats. Hey. And, uh, I adapted it to fit in there for her to sit on. So. Hi. Hey. neighborhood I can't do anything else Sometimes on you. 
when you first start out and that's pretty much like this thing does if you don't watch what you're doing Okay, let me have it and I'll show them how you get in and out of it. Better push that forward a little more. Okay. Now bear in mind, I am 75 years old and my wife here is 74. And so we don't need something that was real fast and hard to deal with and all that. And as you can see, it, it worked pretty easy for her to get in and out of it. And uh, the little extreme bike still works perfect. That other gas thing that I got from that place I did the other thing on, it still doesn't work. It's sitting up there in the, in the garage. And... Uh, Anyway, we dubbed this one, like I said, Miss Prissy, what I call my wife anyway. So we had this tag made, a uh, place on eBay made it for us. And here's that Ozark Trail um, seat that I was telling you that I bought from Walmart. And there it is sitting inside of it. And Marie, my wife uses this pillow to this bar, she said, hurts her back a little bit. And you see the, um, the windshield was easy to bolt on with two bolts into that thing. There's where I had my horn, which I got that other one coming. I'll put it back when I get it. And uh, as she said, this is our home here in West Virginia. Sistersville. In Sistersville, West Virginia. So... We're kind of up underneath a, a lot of trees right here, as you can see. And there's that, that hill right from our house. And we ride it up. Now, I weigh about 235, and my wife's about 150, I guess, or 140, somewhere around in there. Okay, 134. Okay, 134. And as you can see, we got a good little size hill going up into our garage and it pulls right up in it I'm trying and, to lose weight. but without that uh without that um little bicycle motor that i bought off of ebay in no way it would go up in there even when we didn't have the cart on with both of us on it and so here is the our garage where we bring it down this hill and it's a little flat right here but it drops off onto a hill, so now she's going to record me driving. Riding. There he goes to get on it, praise the Lord. We have so much fun. It is just absolutely fun. And, and to, we bought one for him and one for me, but then I wanted us to be right together all the time, so he made the little sidecar. <laughs> and see him taking off in it there? There he goes around yep you probably won't go too far but as you can see he's going down the road and everything i got holding it up as far as i can he's coming back now we really like it because it gives us something to do, and it, and we're together. Praise the Lord. Here he comes back. 
riding a little scooter. Hi, honey. Okay. All right. Hi. <laughs> now he's going to go down that way where that little hill is I was telling, he was telling you about. Amen. But we like it. It's something for us to do, something else. And we just put our little bike hats on and go. <laughs> and like I said, he's still got his red bike too and everything. So he's coming back this way now. Driving along. There he goes. Hi. It's 34 now. 34 now. Oh my. He can probably get a little bit more speed in things when I'm not in it, you know. Here he comes. I think that is the greatest thing that he did, and he built it all. And and okay, he's going up in our driveway right now with it. There he goes. Right. Now watch him go. There he goes. He's backing it around. And that's our little electric car in the garage. Stand right there, hon. Let me get you good. All right. We just have fun. God's been good to us. Amen. And that's my wife, <laughs> and here we are uh, out here in WV. I hope you all liked our video. Uh, we sure like our little bike. God bless you. And thank you. And that's it. Bye. <laughs>